what's up you guys Cynthia so today I'm doing a video and it's called spring essentials so this week I have been so busy and Thursday I had new tires put on my vehicle Friday I was busy all day Saturday I was busy today I came home from church and started I literally got everything set put on comfy clothes and yeah so let's hop right into the video first off we have makeup so for me I think for like springtime they're going with that kind of like just just like not using a lot of foundation so I will be using because I'm really excited to try this product is the benefits the professionals and this is really cool I used it a couple times and it's really nice and um it's like minimize your pores I have one right here and I have one right here yes they're literally right here and here it's embarrassing but I've been using that on there and it's been really nice and I'm really liking this a lot and like it's really nice and I paid I think like five bucks for this I don't remember like ten or something it was I was like ridiculous like I was like I paid this much for this tube so next up we're talking eyeshadow for me I've been using the naked 2 for all of winter so I am gonna be trying out Elf's the baked eyeshadows I got this for Christmas and it just looks like this looks like that and I will be personally probably using this color right here I'm sorry I can't I'll be using this color right here and probably these top colors except the one on the end so that I'll be using this palette and I'm really excited to use this one because last night I experimented with colors and tried to figure out if I had any colors that I liked in other palettes that looked like any of these colors so next up the I'm gonna be trying um, so a couple months ago when I went to Ulta I got in um, one of the cream eyeshadows and I got it in shimmering topaz it looks like I'm sorry guys looks like that I'm sorry weird angles my lights right there uh, and I got it in shimmering topaz and I swatched it last night <laughs> this is sound gonna sound really funny I got home from um, babysitting a couple kids and I had swatched it on my hand right here like right here and that's after I had swatched all that and I had it starting up my arm and just going down to my finger all the way to here so I would wiped it all off and then I tried that and I before I went to fell asleep I literally took my makeup off and I'm half asleep just rubbing in my arm trying to get it off and I was like oh, that'll do and went to bed so yeah next up we have Avon's always on point and I'm gonna be talking about not in K1 is in 402 um, lavender gray I think this is a nice good one F personally what I would do would probably be which I might do is take this one and do my usual like line and then get like which I hate using and use a stick um, this is wet and wild um, like just this is like a pencil and just lining it and it'll be quicker but although I might use my CoverGirl one, I love that one. We have hmm, nail polish. I have one color which actually is on my nails. I talked about in, I think in winter, about a color I was liking, which was probably snow. But right now, and I think I might have talked about it, this is CoverGirl's Outlast Stay Brilliant Nail Polish in Sweetwater Taffy. I love this color because it's like it's just like a light green it's very fresh and I really like it and like I did really good on my nails I tried this new hack and it was really cool I saw on Twitter and it looked really cool I was really happy with that next up we have just kind of like some odd ends in makeup care now you're gonna be like Cynthia this is weird so truthfully I love scented deodorants like that's one of my favorite things if we're talking my favorite scented deodorant is secrets Paris Paris is my absolute favorite secret deodorant but I like for springtime I'm gonna be using secrets Brazil 
And I really love the sprint, the smell of Brazil. Because it's just so, like, how do I describe this? Because it just smells so good. It's just, like, very, like, rain, it's actually called Rainforest Mist. It's just very Rainforest-esque, as it's called Rainforest Misk. Mist, but I really like this and I'm really excited to use this. And for those days when you're on the go, I am going to be using um, Vaseline's um, Intensive Care Spray Moisture Spray On um, in Cocoa Radiant um, Lotion. You just spray it on. And what I do is I spray it on and then I rub it in because, like, you need to rub it in, guys. And do that. And then I'm like, boom, good. And I really like this stuff. I've been using um, Vaseline's um, one in the bottle. And I love it. I love Cocoa Radiant. It's my favorite smell from Vaseline. Okay. So, a couple weeks ago, they were having a deal on perfume. And I got Our Moment by One Direction. I'm really excited to have used this for, like, the springtime. Because I love the scent of this. Oh, it's just so fresh. And I love it so much. It just smells so good. And I'm really excited to use this. I've used a little bit, but I just really like this. And that's like one thing for me is I actually have to really like a scent to get it. And I really like this. And I was really shocked because when I got, when I saw it, I was like, I smelt it. I was like, ooh, I like that. And I got it. And when I first, when it first came out, like our moment came out, and I was like, I'm not gonna like this. I'm not gonna like it, and I'm not gonna like it. It's like the one, by the way, this is by One Direction. One Direction's our moment. But, um, when I first came out, I'm like, I'm not buying that. It's not gonna be that good. Like, I'm not gonna go into the hype and try it, and oh my goodness, totally worth it. It smells so good, and I just love it. So, if you didn't know, I love Converse. I have a gray pair, which I wore today. A blue pair that I just DIY'd. If you saw in my winter haul, you saw these didn't have strings. I ripped all the stitching out of them and made them put strings in them. And I love them. Eh, and I love them so much. And I'm really excited to wear these. Oh, I gotta fix my hair. And then, of course, I have my white Converse, which I absolutely love, if you didn't know that. White is actually one of my favorite colors, and white Converse are actually my favorite shoe out of the Converse colors, but my white Converse. The other product that is that kind of, like, theme of it is sunglasses. If you didn't know that, if you didn't know, and if you're new to my channel, I love sunglasses. I have a lot of pairs of them. Now, there's either two styles I have. I have surfers, which this is two pairs of mine. So, I have these green ones I've had for, I think, two years. And I love, my second favorite color is green. Well, it used to be, but I love green. And I love these because they're really, like, really soft. And, like, they just fit on my face. And they're perfect. Which, I'll probably wear these for St. Patrick's Day. Because be like, I'm wearing green. Ha ha. And then my other favorite pair of surfer sunglasses are these ones. These are actually my favorite color of blue. They're reflective, and I love them so much. As you can see, the right there, you can see what I'm filming. So, yeah. Now, the next two pairs are, like, I call them my favorite pairs. So, I have these ones I have that I've had for, like, six months that I wear... All the time and I love these so much and I just love these because they're just so cool and I love the top of these if you see any selfies on Twitter or something they're really good now my newest pair which I got a couple weeks ago are these ones they look like this I got these two pairs at Target on um, these ones I love I literally, this is about this little thing right here, I've been trying to find a pair that looks like this, and I absolutely love these so much. And yeah. Now, when I talked about in my last video, I think it was, or two videos ago about my essentials, I talked about a book 
was gonna read. I have not touched it. It's still sitting over there. I'm gonna be hopefully cracking into this week. Next week is Marcus Butler's Hello Life. I love Marcus Butler, and when his book came out, I was all for it. And I'm really excited for it. And, yeah. Dang it. Alright. Last up, we have music. Now, if you didn't know, I love music. I listen to a lot of music, so, like, music's one of my favorite things. So, first off, some of the music that I think that's very spring-esque is, um, Roses by the Chain Smokers versus Ro featuring Roses. I'm going to put these names on the screen and in the description, so you guys need to go check them out. The Chain Smokers is Roses and, um, Chain Smokers versus Z featuring Daya with Don't Let Me Down is like, I love that song so much. I got addicted to it a couple weeks ago and I have been loving it and it's so good. Next up is Youth by Troy Sivan. If you didn't know, his video came out I think three weeks ago. Troy Sivan's Youth. It is number, like, let's look right now. I'm really curious. What number is Troy Sivan's Youth in the iTunes Top 100? Here we go! I'm really excited to see this. He is number... Wait, what? He was number 8 yesterday. He's number 9 again. Really? Really. Okay, guys. Go download Youth. I love this song so much. And it's my favorite song off of Troy Sivan's EP, Blue Neighborhood, which is my favorite album. Next up is actually number six in the iTunes Top 100, which is Stressed Out by 21 Pilots. I really, for some reason, I'm liking that song a lot. I heard it on the radio a couple weeks, a couple days ago, and I've been loving it, and it's so good. Now, my other one I've been liking is Cake by the Ocean by DNCE. And I like the radio edit version. I heard the explicit version. And I do listen to a lot of explicit music. And I listen like they have swear words in them. I'm used to that. But like hearing the clean version is so much better I think. Because it's just more. I think it's better. It, it, I just I don't like the swearing in that one. But yeah guys. So thanks for watching guys. See you guys next time. Don't forget to like, subscribe, follow my social media links in the down bar below. Check out my last video. Where? I? What did I do last video? Talked all about high-end makeup. Go check it out. That was actually one of my favorite uh, video. I loved filming because I got to talk about all my favorite high-end products. So, yeah, guys. So, thanks for watching, guys. Now, the week I'm uploading it, the week after, actually, the week I'm uploading it, that Friday starts my spring break. So, I plan on doing a tutorial if you have any ideas you want me to do put them in the comments below or tag me on twitter my username is at under at penguin underscore crb it is the second that's the it's in my social media links in the down below check it out see you guys next time bye guys